Let me ask you something. Are you someone who gets it? Are you familiar with this phrase? If you stick around, I'll explain and demonstrate how this concept can benefit your anxiety, ADHD, and mental health in general. Many people get frustrated and make a bad decision. We all do at times. However, some people have a tendency to self-reflect afterwards. These are people who get it. And unfortunately, there are people who just don't get it. It could be that they rationalize their own contradictions by telling themselves things like, no, that doesn't apply to me. Another way of describing such behavior is a double standard. It is subtle though, however, that doesn't mean it's not harmful. It can drastically affect one's life. One individual we came across with this tendency worked in a volunteer organization. Many of the other volunteers often found his comments to be overly critical and obnoxious. He felt he was just being honest with them. He was a hard worker but lacked insight into his own behavior. This pattern continued for a number of years. Fortunately, at one point, he received feedback about his behavior from a colleague. He held his colleague in high esteem, so he was open to their input. He was surprised by the feedback at first, but eventually got it. He came to realize the implications of repeating this behavior where his relations with others were soured. He recognized the value of improving his relations with others. How important is getting it for someone suffering from stress, anxiety, and ADHD? Well, it's very important, and here's why. It will improve your relations with others. It can lead to your recognition of the challenges you have and ultimately to their solutions. If you have trouble recognizing what interpersonal difficulties you may be overlooking or what challenges are experiencing, consider obtaining help from a professional. In closing, here are two quick tips for getting started with self-reflection today. Schedule time into your calendar to be more self-reflective of your actions and reactions and ensure you follow through on this commitment. Remember the rewards of the self-reflective process. It can help your anxiety, improve your relationships with others, and improve the quality of your life in general. For an extended version of this discussion, feel free to listen to our podcast episodes on iTunes or by clicking on the card on the upper right corner of this video and subscribing to our free newsletter. This will ensure that you don't miss out on any of our content. Thank you for watching this video and as usual, we look forward to presenting a new video in our series next week.